Okay, so this is good. Saw runs. Um, we'll, uh, the belts have been uh, sort of run in initially, so they're going to get tightened now. And we'll find out now if they actually are a match set or not. Uh, I'm a little dubious about that, but uh, we'll see. Hopefully I am surprised. Uh, we've determined that this fence here is not going to be um, what I'm looking for. It's going to be fine for carpentry, general purpose kind of work. It's not going to cut it for cabinetry, furniture making. Um, could it be worked over, used? Sure. But it's going to take a new set of rails. It's going to take addressing this face skin issue. Uh, it's going to take some sort of, probably some sort of, uh, some sort of UHMW slide or button or something underneath. Uh, it's going to, you know, it's, it's a bit of a project. I don't really want a project. And the Beesmeyer style is not something I love anyways. So, so instead, we're going to replace it with one of these. A Delta Uni fence. It's a fence I'm very comfortable with. Um, I love it. In my opinion, it's one of the most versatile and safe fences uh, that is modernly made. Now, I say that, they're not made anymore, uh, unfortunately. Um, as far as I know, they all of these were American made uh, up until they stopped making them. Uh, someone can correct me if that's wrong. But, um, they're not made anymore. Unfortunately, you can't just order a new one. But there's enough of these sitting around. You can find some really nice ones. Or you could refurbish one. Uh, I found this one and it's in fantastic condition. And um, quite honestly, uh, even though the shipping was $100, um, I was happy to, to pay the shipping just, just to get this unit. There's a lot of things to love about this fence. Uh, and there's a couple of downsides to it too. I'm gonna cover that in a different video. We don't need to get into all that now. But uh, what we do need to know is that, although this guy came in in a week or so, the rail for it is coming from a different company. And that's apparently going to be a six to eight week wait, uh, which we're only a couple weeks in. So I can either just put this project on hold, or I've got some stuff I wouldn't mind using it for. So uh, we are going to set up the Beesmeyer. Uh, we will use the Beesmeyer uh, because it's just, it's kind of some rougher work stuff that we're doing. And we should be able to make this fence work fine. Uh, honestly, my biggest concern with it is the wave that is in this uh, nylon board edge. Um, I, I don't know what I'm going to do about that. And I think I might just try working with it as it is. This one on this side actually looks fair but straighter. So maybe I might flip them over. Something like that. But I was wondering if I could take this rail off leaving these nylon sides and actually run this one over a jointer. I don't know what that would be like running nylon on a jointer. Uh, it might be fine. It could be a really bad idea. Might see if uh, I can find anyone else who's done that first. So then I had the thought, well, without being too much trouble, we could actually probably just screw a hardwood face onto this nylon. As long as I set the screws in at least a quarter inch or so, should be able to run that fence, the wood portion, on the joiner. Now, that would allow me to give a nice flat reference plane and square to the bottom side. Um, two things that this fence doesn't have at the moment. <laughs> uh, you know, if you're going to build a fence, you should probably start off with straight and square. And if you can't get straight and square, maybe don't worry about any of the other stuff yet. But, whatever. Covering up the name, I'm not calling anyone out. So anyways, we'll, we'll go through that, and uh, we'll go through that process, and you'll see a, a basic setup. And, yeah. All right, anyways, that's, that's it. That's where that's at. That's where this is all at. We're just about done with this saw. Uh, we're getting into the setup phase, which is really great because uh, that usually goes pretty quick and it means we're just both time to start using it. Okay, follow me down below.